Now, um, saying the stream health is good, so we're going to presume that it's fine. Maybe. I don't know. Any vis audible changes? Ping change? No. Ping's still good, really. Hey, look at that. I could stream videos now and not have the internet kill itself. I, I'm fine with this. Hmm. Yes. Alright. I am now going to check YouTube. On my phone. Providing I can find it. Hello? Where did you go? There you are. I think it's working. Oh, yep, it's working. Hell bells and conquer shell. All right. Um. I think I should hear you. In a second. Say something in the stream. I did earlier. Gonna hear if the... I'm hearing, I think I see anything. I don't know. Fine, I'll figure it out sooner or later. Oh, it's. Yeah, because it's got a latency, that's why. Oh, yep, it is. Okay. It's got like a three minute delay. And it'll be fine. Um. So I will keep that open just to monitor the chat if there is one. Uh, let me. So now, what I will do, because I am an idiot. I <laughs> because I'm an idiot. Well, I knew that. Well, go on. Uh. <laughs> I'm doing that. Then I will put this in the, uh, the videos, images and videos, why not, we'll put it there, that'll be fun, people could witness the stupidity that happens, alright, so I'll leave that to do its destruction of its own device, and I shall get in the seat of this chooch, and start to do chooch things, I guess, I don't know. Are you ready to move? Yep, alright, after I send a message to someone. Alright. We are ready to roll whenever. Oh. There's a jelly table. Finding random oh. stuff on my table. Well, get your lights on. Alright. Um, providing I remember that button. Six. There's Three. Alright. That, that turned, like, the brightness on. Yep, there we go. Alright, take it in. Give him Aiden. One second. Camera went haywire. Alright, taking it in my head. You got a lot of power behind you, so just keep it under. Alright. At least I have a speedometer. What Whoa. happened? What happened? Ah, the collisions. It's just on that long engine. We're good. Keep moving. Probably have to no quite world some of the other ones because we're gonna go for that bridge and station. We should be fine. I've ran that engine before. All right. I'll take your three. Word. Three. One. That'll do. That'll do. Wow. Alright, let's roll. The interior. That's like quality. That doorknob or door latch or whatever it is. Alright. 
slowly get up to speed here. say it would be a good speed restriction on this locomotive. Where are you at now? Uh, 23. Don't do any more than 30. All that right. goes for everything. Alright, I'll try. You got dynamics, too. Mm. Alright. Since we have a whole bunch of motive power, that should be very effective. Well, that's why you rather have more power for dynamic braking than actual power. Oh, oh. we're off, we're off. The hell happened? What Switch happened? That section. What happened? What happened? Keep going. Um, we're, we're still, we're still, yeah, I, I don't, okay, thank you. <laughs> Move. I'm moving. been engineer for five minutes and we're already zero. Not even five minutes. We'll wait till you see our train. Lord. I think blinds hand the stream. It's not that much of a latency, so that's good. It's at the point where we just hopped off the track. Slow it down. And this next curve up here is a bit. See the problem. You got that General Electric off. Again? It's gonna be a fun day. General Electric piece of shit. Alright, keep it at 20. <laughs> okay. It may take three hours to get this job done. But at least it's going to be safe. All right. Noted. Keep just keep it at one. Both trucks. Jesus Christ. What is the um, the practicality of having a General Electric on board? It's not very good. Keep moving. All right. Just keep it at twenty. Keep it at twenty. Each curve we've gone around, we've to break. Well, um, make for a fun stream. It's funny, because all the times I've ran trains in this game, I've never used a dynamic brake up until this point. I've just forgot they exist. One of your companies have gone down the pot, you keep using all the money on brake shoes. That explains it. Oh, I forget there's a crossing in here. Keep driving, I'll keep my on eye on back there. Alright.
Oh, I just remembered something. We gotta do our tribute. To the cows? To the cows. Well, that'll be farther down the line. Don't worry, be worrying about that. Alright, let me know when we get up close on it. Because I know I'm gonna miss it. Actually, no, I shouldn't, because it's near that house. EOT tool. All right, take it ahead. Mm -hmm. All right, take it ahead. Well, I need to get back on. So keep it slowed down. Don't stop. All right. I'll keep get on that rear engine so I don't have to walk all the way back. Good. All right. That's a violation. You're blocking crossing. Hush. Crew last night didn't have time to split the train up. Alright, fair enough. I have a, they've got like three other crossings to use, they'll be fine. I don't get that. There's eight tracks here. Or seven. Yep. We'll, we'll pull out that number one rail and then back down on the second cut. Gotcha. I like that like new horny too. The you one gave the me sound. the other day. Oh. Yeah, because I can hear it all the way back here too. That's good. Yeah, I found that. All I was right, like, no, do. All right, that'll do. It. Bring it on back. Give me four up. Oh, keep it slow. 
two. two. Jesus Christ! Mm, shit, I felt that. I forgot we have multiple engines. Hold on. Did I break Take it knuckle? ahead, two feet. I broke the knuckle down. Alright, good. What the hell? <laughs> Bring it back. Good, good. <laughs> Keep coming. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright. Go pin, forward. The pin when I drive. say stop, stop. Alright. Good. You didn't All say stop. Right. Don't argue with me. <laughs> okay. Alright. All right, drag it out. Drag it out. It's called being in the jungle when you're in between two big long cuts like this. It's one hell of a jungle. All right, keep it slow, you're in the yard. About eight cars. All right. Shove back, lined up, back, back. Alright, line it up. Getting three out. Getting three. Out. I'm not gonna screw up this time. Okay. Two. Two. One. One. Half. Half. Slow, 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 slow. Slow. Damn. Did we mess up? No, but you slammed a knuckle hard. Oof. Alright, you got him laced up, drag him out. Alright, dragging him out. What the hell? I can really feel the train. It's sulfur. It's heavy. A lot of battery. Oh, hey, look at that. Someone texted. Ooh, G mod. Ooh, G mod. Whoopee. Quit being distracted. Sorry. <laughs> oh, here I see the cons is slowing. It just God. I've never seen people do this. Well, uh, well, there you go. You're seeing people do it. That's all I could say. I'm a distracted driver. Give me about 15. 15. You want me to roll Four. back and get you? Four? Yeah. Okay. Three. Three. Two. Two. One. One. 
That'll do. And that'll do it. There you go. Alright, line lock for main. Shut back. Shut it back. You know the you know the real reason why I do that, yeah, is so the conductor can get back on and it's also to line those switches back. Ah, I see. Oh, um that was not Hold the phone. Whoa. That was not good, what I just saw. We came off? Yeah. A lot? Um, give you my official statement here in a minute. Oh yeah, a lot. Well, I'm not gonna go back there, just fix it. Uh, gonna need more than a couple 2x4s. Hmm. That's a problem. Alright, let me see if I can fix this problem. I'm gonna have to, um... Oh, brake pressure's at zero. Back here on the EOD. That ain't good. Well, well, is it fixed? No. Not yet. Um... I'm going to maybe need a second hand in all this. Let's, let's see. Well, I'm gonna have to run back there. Uh, well, you could just stay right there. It's. Uh, oh. I'm gonna stretch this out. You don't have to come up here. I'll let you know if I need. Well, you. I'm I'm up here, so I Excuse guess me. I'll stay. Yep. Might as well. I. Uh, okay. Let's stop this here. Keep see going. Where we're at. Keep right. going. I'm oh. your eyes. Okay. Thank you. Engineer Spark. <laughs> One hell of an engineer. I broke the track. Oh, that, that's good, right there. No, actually, it's a break. Just... Well, freeze this car up here. Okay. Then you can do what you want with it. Yeah, because I, I looked back as we started to roll back, and I just see one of the cars just fly up in the air for a minute and then land back down. I'm like, that wasn't good. All right, next. Well, this is a good lesson for you. When you shove back, do it gentle. Yeah, <laughs> I gotta admit, I was a little anxious on the throttle there. Um, well, this is the consequence for that. Yeah. I forgot physics in this game are a little bit touchy. <laughs> well, they're touchy in real life too. Well, that is true. It, it remind seeing that. Hopper just kind of go up in the air reminded me of that video of the um, head-on collision in Mexico where you just see in the background behind that locomotive is yeah <laughs> Hopper fly well, that'll happen <laughs> I mean you find that funny but I mean I think that's just physics at work yeah well I problem's been resolved all right let me set the brakes before we unfreeze the sucker there you go set yep they're set I'm frozen all right all right now shove back all right gonna shove General. back. Shoving back gently. Trying too hard not to give it the beans. Completely. Oh, there's a flying person. I guess. Oh, that's a bird. Oh, yes. See, that's how you shove. Right. See, now there's no issue. I'm where you left me. Alright. The problem is I left you way back at the beginning of the yard, so did you walk all oh, the way well, back? Well, I'm, I'm on the south end. Uh, alright, alright. Fair enough. Slow it. Slowing. I'm not on the tail end of that train to see what's going on. So if you hit somebody, you won't hit him as fast. Ah, okay. Darn. Really wanted to maim someone. Right under that wheel. <laughs> right under that You know what's always got me in Gary's mind? What's that? When you see a train rolling past, there's absolutely no sound. Fair point. Well, that, um, whatever his name is, the guy from New Zealand, he made that new blue car thing. Yeah. yeah. 
I could never say his name correctly, so I choose not to say it. Got five cards. Five cards. That'll do. That'll do. Okay, anywhere here is good. Making sure we're not derailed back there with that bad second the track. Alright. Whenever you are ready, sir. Uh, whenever you get up here. Hi. How you doing? Horrible. Oh. Wow. Wow. Alright. Okay. Highball. Port Town. Alright. Highball. Number 20. Yep. It'll be a long day. And now that we've got weight back there, maybe it won't derail as much. Oh, the exact opposite is true. Yeah, fair enough. a fun balancing game. You're in control. Yeah. That's what scares me. <laughs> you want me to be over there? Ah, I should be fine. I am absolutely plastered my face to the speedometer. Dynamic break. This can really be so just wet. Uh, well, yes. yeah, it does. You can take it or leave it how you like. We scared off the player base, but we're still here. <laughs> got the got the cows off on the conductor side. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna even text or The horn. Yep. Lost their lives in the house fire. And, uh, or however they died, I can't remember. Those poor cows. Alright. Dynamics. Nope, that's not the dynamics. Where? There you are. Bingo. You're gonna rip off. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to get us under control here. Use your brake if you need to. I'm half tempted to. I wanna try not to cause an accident. There we go. That's a little more under control. And don't be too forceful on your dynamics either. Don't just slam on them. Because that can lift cars off the track. Yeah. You know, just to give you more confidence. Thanks. That's what I needed. Well, this, this is... This Here, is here's a, a railroad city. question for you. All What's right. the hardest train to run? What kind of question is that? What's the hardest type of train to run? Uh... A downhill? What's what type, not all oh. situation? I don't think you think too well. <laughs> no, my brain is shot. What do you think? A mixed brain. Ah, okay. Really? Because you have loaded and unloaded cars. Ah, that makes sense. Yeah, I can see where that would get you. Those rocketing for us curves doing above 20. That scares me if that GE back there. Oh, it's Shortliner. What's up, Short? I'm Been a minute, hasn't it? Yeah, you blew that one to hell. Yeah, I did.
don't know why I'm texting this. You could just get it. I'm a dumbass sometimes. Ah, drops phone. My coworker is playing a game now. I just got the notification. Alright. Time to take it out of dynamic. Believe it or not, these engines have actually pretty good visibility. Yeah, I do like it. Pretty nice. One thing I never... I remember we had... I had one of these once, and it was back on AM when they had two of them from CM. But I don't like about... The one thing I really didn't like about them is they have something called a steep front. Where all your like everything's just squished together up front. So think about it. if you open this front door, yeah, and you trip, you're going down. You're going down. Yeah. There's nothing like you can try to catch yourself, but there's nothing to really catch you. But like some like maybe an SD40-2, if you trip and fall, you've got a big deck to land on. You know. Yeah. You distracted. Yeah, I'm working on it. Quit cowtown in the short line and get back here. The problem is I only look down for a minute and all hell breaks loose. Alright, there you go. Short liner, God love you, but my engineer here can't get distracted. Well, how about you open up a an internet tab on your phone and watch the chat. Fine. <laughs> I, I need that thing that those fancy people from Twitch have where the chat just pops up on your screen. You can just watch it from there. I don't yeah, know. I've got it up. Okay. Two people are watching. Whew. Amazing. It, it bounces because there was a third person. I glanced at it every now and then. Two day. people. Two people. Two whole people. Subconsciously clicked on your live stream. The problem is one of them is probably me because I have it open on my phone. <laughs> so that would do it. Now I guess since Shortliner probably needs to be updated on a few things, basic terminology of what's all changed. Uh, new models, a few new maps, standard gauge is now out. Uh, TP3 finally came out. Yeah. If you're still watching, watch, he laughs, so we're just talking to ourselves. Probably. Yeah, I'll see it in their, their rerun. But, um, this is an actual Track Pack 3 that we're on now. This is a bootlegged version of it before it came out. But, hey, it's still standard gauge. We have dramatically slow. Oh, it's because I'm still in dynamic mode, duh. You scared me, Spark. I know. Because you know what happens in Gary's mod that causes a train to dramatically slow down. I know. I've had constant nightmares of that. Uh, yes, this will do nicely. We're just gonna let gravity do its thing from here on out. This is a very sharp curve up here. You better not just let it do what it wants. Yeah, don't worry, it'll have a cap on it. <laughs> Nervously grabs the dynamic. No cap. more than 20 per. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing. You know what 50. I found interesting about this model? What's that? They apparently thought this big. 
structure in the front of the cab was a cab heater. Really? That's a door. Huh. It's a door. Well, I kind of figured that because you showed me that. They thought it was a heater. I remember when we were talking about the A&M, you, you mentioned Yeah, I know. I mentioned It's a door, but everyone yeah. thinks it's a heater. No, I, it's a door. I guess it's because of the shape. Live re. Well, well, has discovered. We a got live a Carl. Team. Carl? Where's Carl? We've got a car off. Oh, car off. I thought you said Carl. We got a Carl. We've got Carl. He says. Where's the car? It's two cars deep. Damn. Release. Released. Um, hello, person. I don't know. There are people. Watching? Yeah, apparently. Holy shit. Uh, four four All right, whopping apply. Things. Applied. Unfrozen. Alright. Release. Alright, we're going. Look at that, we're running a train, people. If that's fascinating to everyone, there you go. It's incredibly fascinating. Yeah. Alright. Coming into town through here. Oh, is it that weird? Yeah, it's that weird town. Kids. Oh. Every time come for this town, it's always a horn show. Yeah, because you got two crossings that are less than 100 feet from each other. I've always liked this little section right here. A little zigzag for the valley. Yeah. Leveled out, I could let it coast. Yeah, that was a good little section there. I do like the parts of this map that he's developed up there. Alco Chug. Excuse me, MLW. Yeah, almost same thing. Alco with Canadian sprinkles. Yep. Eh, it works. Did we make a version of this with the same body, just with the wide cab on it? The Comfort Cab? The Grove made that one. Oh, did he? West completely redid it. Made this version. Oh, okay. <sighs> Next town is Mecklenburg. I'll be honest, there's a lot more MLW's models in this game now. I was confused on which is which now. I like MLW, I don't mind. Yeah, I don't mind it either. It just it confuses me. So many of them. I don't know. That's just me. You know what my new favorite commercial is? What's that? A bath, the bathtub with a door. Bathtub with a 
No, wait, what? <laughs> the one for old people. Ah, oh, the, yeah. And the reason why it is is because my dad always joked that he would never get one. That's what he did last week. Got one. <laughs> said up until a certain point I would never move to Florida guess what happened well you always said you would I know but then I changed my mind halfway through watch you'll go to California then. I don't want to say never on that one because it could happen why would you go to California I have no idea alright here comes the fun part of the line we don't have long ass cars. Just keep it at about 15. Kids. Down on the lake. What happened? Did I do that? I did that. Huh? I'm mistaken. What? I, I phased out. I, I I did too. My brain went in autopilot for a minute, just slammed on the brake, and then I forgot to take off the brake. Oh well. I wanna this bridge would already be in the river. God bless it. That is a train behind us. No here doubt. I and here at the throttle. Quite a responsibility, isn't it? I don't know how I feel. Welcome to my world. <laughs> Keep your bell on, you're in the middle of downtown Mecklenburg. No, I refuse. It's like downtown Fayetteville on A&M, it's just... You've got everything around you. I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, people. I'm coming through. Beep beep. I'm about to make everyone deaf too. So don't blow your horn. Just do two sh short little blasts. Just like that. That's one way to do it. It's a quaint little house with a fenced yard. Nice little place. Then a the train goes around there. They're probably used to it. Well, I imagine living next to the main line. Apparently this map was based in the 60s, 1860s. Yeah, uh, during the so. Civil War. So uh, at that point in time, they, they would have been steam locomotives and their one chimed whistles. At least they think they're one chimed. I couldn't tell you much on that. A horn's a horn. I don't understand all this talk over different horns and stuff. Yeah. Alright, here we go. We're going downhill again. That doesn't mean the rest of your train is with you. It's still all the way back in Mecklenburg. Yeah. I'm just preparing for that time when gravity starts taking hold. I already have it set to dynamic. I'm just waiting for the speed to go. Tiny little FJ cruiser just sitting on the keyboard. Can do anything. You put it there. Yep.
far so good. Yes, sir. There's that little crossing of that small siding. Oh. Yeah, there's a return, Joe. Okay. okay. Fair enough. Well, you'll be in an American built EMD product on the way up. Oh, okay. That's fine. Oh, I was speaking to like this look. <laughs> nah, I do like it. Nothing wrong with it. locomotive that I have a problem with is that GE back there. <laughs> Hadn't even ran it and he hates it. Yep. Doesn't that say something? No, oh, the only locomotive I could ever say that I've ran is an EMD. That was from the 50s, and that's it. We got the cooler! The cooler? Oh, no. Where's the cooler? I don't know. Looking for a damn water. <laughs> Where's the cooler? Oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> uh, that was entertaining. I love that story. And bounces like a hooker. Oof. Yeah. It is. We got a sand job to take back up. Uh, that'd be fun. I got the power for it. Water tower. Look at that, it's one of Paul's great great ancestors. We got kids up there. Oh. Are they happy? They left. I oh. walked away. Damn. I think the measurement of this thing is off. The, uh, um, the, the YouTube. There's it's no... It's measuring it? Uh, measuring the views of people. It's saying there are currently zero people watching, but my phone is still, in fact, too in watching. I think you did a good job because that curve will eat any engine up. Oh. I just had the instinct of hitting the brake and then just for no reason. Oh, here's your license. What? No, I don't want it. <laughs> I, ain't I am dynamic, okay. Good. I don't hear a bell ringing. Oh. I don't know the pop, proper horn application for a diamond, so I'm just not going to honk at all. You don't. You don't honk at all. Okay, good. Unless the other crew waiting for you is flipping you off. Okay. Fair enough. 
Guess what's next? That bridge. Mm -hmm. That lovely, lovely bridge. Oh, you too. Now put your bad section track back on. No. For the love of God, uh, no. That was funny. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> you remember the, the the one guy that came on here and he'd complain about it? He was like, like this map sucks. <laughs> that was funny. Say something. Oh yeah, you two heard my complaint and fixed the view counter. The one singular view is back. Oh shit! The guy with the two people watching his streams complaining better fix it. <laughs> what importance I have to them, I guess. I Oh yay, this thing. This lovely thing. It ain't a bad bridge. Yeah. When you're going the opposite direction, it gets wonky though. Yeah. Keep the train going somewhat slow over this. All the power can fit on it. Look at that. One hell of a view, I'll, I'll say that much. Yeah, I like the P and G trees. <laughs> yes. That's gorgeous. Absolutely breathtaking. Look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Truly astonishing. Something you have to be aware of when you're running one of these. Yeah. Oh, my old long guy. Yeah, not in this game, but in reality. Alright. You got one, two, three, four more corners to do. Alright. I kind of figured we were far from we're not gonna pull into the yard all right i'm gonna delete the consist and then i'll put in the sand cut in the yard then we'll grab it swap ends all right and we'll head right back up because this obviously ain't gonna fit in the yard yeah i'm just gonna bend logic and reality for a minute as we slightly take that and we're two miles above what i wanted to go at speed you better be careful. Uh, it's a lot of money behind you. I know. Try not to let it get away from me. It's only two miles difference. It's just a recommendation. Locate the bell on this end. Um, underneath the frame. Or can you point it out to me? Well, hell, it's on the engineer side. Okay. Under your feet. Yeah. I didn't realize that. I, I, I came across the initial thought of saying it standard from the factory it's underneath the frame but then I realized some railroads order standard from the factory to be elsewhere. But, oh well. Well the 
Originally, it would have been above, the, like how CN does, they have the bell. Oh, in front of the right cabin. up front. Yeah. Yeah, right up front. I got. We it. ripped it off and glued it under there. <laughs> it's glued. It ain't bolted. Is it serious? No. Okay, I was gonna say. I heavy had, ass glue. I was gonna say that's a good grade. No, of glue. we scotch taped it. Oh, well, fair enough. Of two rolls of scotch tape, finally. Yeah. <laughs> you hit a we bad had to section around of railing. A prank line to hold. You hit a bad section of rail and it just falls off. <laughs> You're ding along the ballast. <laughs> <laughs> Muffled as shit. Jesus Christ. That would be the day. Just sitting there at the crossing, a train goes by, and I watch the bell fly. It. Just fall Free off. bell, mm, drive home with that. <laughs> I'll throw that in the back of my car. Mine now. It was like the it was like some I saw the other day. A pie eating you're entered in a pie eating contest. You start, you pick up the pie and you get in your car and leave. Free pie! Free <laughs> You're not gonna waste it, it's free pie. You're gonna stop right before these switches up here. All you right. better break now because you gotta have a lot of stopping distance. On top of it. All right. Right here. Or... <laughs> yeah, that'll do. Oh, we made. <laughs> what I'm gonna do? Question is, what kind of pie is it? Oh, pumpkin pie. Ooh, I'll take that. Fifty-two twenty-seven. <laughs> oh. Wait a second, Andrew. Seagulls. seagulls. Oh, seagulls. regular birds at the moment. Oh, no, there's an eagle. Here I am. I found myself. You what? I found it. Uh -huh. There's under underneath the bed. What did you find underneath the bed? The monster. Oh. Somehow knew he was gonna say that. Um, what kind of monster? My yard foreman. Oh, um, that's that's the worst kind of monster you could ever find. I'd be terrified too if I found that underneath my bed. I don't even work for the railroad. <laughs> you ready? Uh, yes. Oh, look Take it at, in. All right, look at that. The rest of the train just disappears magically. Blow that horn again. I like that echo. Yes. Oh, it's still in dynamic. You dumb. <laughs> you dumb. You, you, know, you dumb. To himself. Yeah. I tend to uh, speak in third person a lot of the times. I don't know why. Saddest part is sometimes I answer myself back going, well, I know that, you fucking idiot. <laughs> you need a mental evaluation. I do. I really do. <laughs> yeah, it keeps myself entertained when I'm driving. My car. But, you know. My vacuum cleaner. Yes. Vacuum cleaner. Oh, 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 oh. What vehicle do I prefer to take to work today? Oh, the vacuum cleaner. I'm gonna mop the driveway with it. That'll be fun.
Not hearing any measurements, but all right. Oof. Hold on. All right. All right, go ahead, swap in. Uh, what's the button to disable the Nine. Nine. All right. Oh, should I have flipped the dimmer switch off? Just turned the light off. Oh, uh, what was, it was six. You're getting smarter each day. Oh, I guess I'll take that as a compliment. I don't know. It was a compliment. You're getting dumber every day. I'll also take that as a compliment. <laughs> I bet it's a better, more of a compliment than saying you're getting smarter every day. It actually is. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... Damn it, we just went through this. Okay, that... Nope, that was already on. It's three the dimmer switch? Well, I'll sit here until you figure it out. Hell, I don't know. I'll just go on without it. Uh, Alright, then... Nine was the thing. There we go. Alright. Wait, do that again. No, oh, there we go. Okay, good. Took a minute to register. We're good. Alright. So, now with that, uh, take what? Uh, what? You're in the... I like sitting back here. Alright, alright. Fair enough. Alright, away we go. We're gonna sit up front. A little bit more. Return money. trip, return trip. Right. Crews always chant that. Return trip. Barco. How about I just have the speedometer there by unwire it? You're gonna drive me insane. That'll be more aggravating than not having one. Yeah. You would drive me crazy. Look behind you. Hello? Oh, hi. It's the orange dreamsicle. That was always the funny thing. I always looked at the ICG paint scheme and went, that's the orange dreamsicle. Alright, we better be careful with this power. This will be fun. God, don't let that G come off. Oh, thank God. Just keep it slow getting out of the yard until you're around this next man. Yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing. I just don't want to degrade too much of speed. I'm trying to keep it around 10. Oh, we're not sure. The hell? Oh, air conditioner came on. There ain't no AC. Nah, is it my room right now? No. <laughs> The problem is where my room is now situated at, the, um, the, uh, central air unit is where my closet should be. You don't have a closet? Nope. I'd go crazy without having a closet. Where do you put your clothes? In the dresser. Oh. Shirts and all? Yep. That's weird. I've always had a closet and I put my shirts and stuff in there. Well, originally it was a combination. It was the dresser and the closet, but since I don't have a closet now, it's in the dresser. Well, fully now. And, well, we're gonna climb a little bit here. You better slow down. You're going over a rough section. Oh. Now he's See those me. engines rocking back there? Oh, no. Yeah, I forgot we have that thing that's still back there. Okay. Yeah, we have a train behind us. Yeah. A different one now, but yeah, the train behind us. Good 
it amazes me how far we came in this game. It really does. From a simple wire thruster train to this. Technology. Where? No, nothing. I just thought of it. Every now and then I'll get that random Speak thought. your mind. Exactly. No, that's too high of a speed. I don't know. It's only a mile or two above, but still too high. side of the speedometer and it's got that like uh, bolt or cup just kind of sticking off the side. You know, I actually don't know what that's for. Really? The ones I've seen don't have it. Huh. What the hell? It's two. Initially I thought it was just a connector going to a wire or something. But that might be what it is because if you look at the bottom of it that little yeah. nipple yeah. It's like a little wire connector, but no, I don't know what that little thing is on the side. Nor do I. When I initially looked at it, just kind of glanced at it a couple times, it made me think of like a, the outside hinge to a door. Like how some, the hinge just kind of hangs off in it. It might be some sort of latch. Or or like, yeah, a latch deal. Or twist thing. I don't know what it is. Uh, oh well mystery for another day, I guess. Well, you know what? why these barcodes are special? Why is they that? call it a speed recorder. It records your speed. Oh. There's a little tape in there. Kind of like how a, um, the things they use to measure earthquakes with. Yeah. It's the same concept, but it measures your speed. Okay. So and that was the earliest form of, like, a black box. Yeah, I was about to say it's in the, basically a black box. But that's all it did. It didn't record throttle, brake, or anything. It just recorded your speed. Okay. And that's what that... See how that... That bottom casing? Yeah. That's where it's housed. Oh, okay. Damn. The more you know. Yeah. Uh, I, I think it actually might be the top. Because see how it hint... There's a big hinge there. Oh, yeah. Where it's designed to open out towards you. Do they still use that functionality in them, or is it just now no. fully the digital? It's all electronic, okay. and the ones that are still used don't have the tape in them anymore. Okay, I want you to listen to me. All right. This cross, every time I have ran a train through this crossing up here, it's derailed me. All right. Take it slow. Take it at about five miles an hour, and I'm going to stay here to look at it. Right. You can go. You can go fine over this bridge, but when you get to that crossing, just keep this train under wraps. Oh hell, I I believe you. I know weird shit happens in this game. Front end. A train. lot of mooses run through here. A lot of mooses. And you haven't put that sign up yet. I should have. Well, I put it up in spawn. Figured the first person that walks out, like the first thing they see when they go through one of the doors, they'll see that sign. So they'll get the general idea. Alright, five miles per hour. You're gonna make 
make sure no flanges are on. Why we go? I don't know what causes it. Alright, going for it five. First engine's over, second is about going over. I'm looking at it underneath the train. Alright. I don't know, like, what it is, because I don't know if the crossing's popping them off or if they're popped already popped off they hit the crossing they're gonna come off or, way, I don't know. way I figure if that because that how that bridge is set up how it kind of drops when you get on the one end I almost mm -hmm. wonder if it just it hits at a certain speed and it pops off and then by the time it reaches the crossing it catches it if it's that combination because if it's just directionally wise coming back up that would be the issue yeah. Because you're immediately coming off that curve and then it's an instant down, down gradient. Because I've noticed that with Sunset Gulch and a few other maps, how they instant curve and then instant drop down. Your wheel has a more chance. The of flanges being, are yeah. really moving around to that crossing, so I think the hitbox might be a little off. Uh, Whatever, you made it through. Oh, that's good. Yeah, actually, yeah, that'd be. If I was him, what I would do. Since he custom made that crossing, what I did with my uh, Alto Pass map for that dirt road crossing, I just made a, took the no draw and I made an invisible slide, like a glider. Or a, what is that word I'm looking for? Not glider. Guider. A guiding mm -hmm. rail that's invisible. And it just kind of guides it away from the crossing. That way it went. Alright, well, you're good. I bump. Alright. I have a six now, I'm just climbing the speed here. Oh, yuck. Oh, you're in that seat now. I don't want to be up front. Should have just a back seat. Yeah, whatever. Right click the seat behind you and hit enter. Via well, I can't do that while I'm moving. Yeah, you can, I've done it before. I'm going to sit here and right click for about an hour. Did you notice there's a new option on like the context menu to disintegrate? Dis yeah. Yeah, I was messing with that earlier. It's like that's new. What's this new update for Gary's mod apparently coming? Um, I don't there. know, but I'm speeding. There you go. That's more like it. I have no idea. I didn't look at the patch notes. I just know it apparently happened. It's usually just for mod creators and stuff. Yeah. Well, I'm a mod creator, and I'm not seeing any of this action. And again, I'm not paying attention. That's the flaw. Now it's mostly Lua. I don't really do much of Lua coding. It's real low. The ICG one, or? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. Just noticed that. That is a bit odd. Well, this engine's a little taller anyway. Wait a minute. Was that the one that. Oh, never mind. That was the 30 that had. Never mind. I almost pulled a stupid. That's mod. a 28 I just kind of revived into my modern standard. Okay. That, that be why. Uh, or it, it, English is it's not. It's literally one of these engines, just yeah, you know, orange and white. Did it use the old truck set and you just model manipulated the new one on there? Or? Oh, like the AARB? Yeah. Oh no, this was like. Well, it was, but no, like I took one of my 28s and repainted it. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Don't have dynamics. Unless Grove did something and it updated the origin point, it sits lower now from its original point. 
No, that's actually ha how high it's supposed to be. It's just this engine's taller. Oh, okay. That makes sense. So yeah, that was an old and then this is a, what, a 50? Yeah, I, I can see it now. As technology, you know, advances. It improves. Improves and advances. Stuff changes and gets bigger. <laughs> it's one way to look at it, I don't know. Bell is pretty easy to locate on this one. Standard, typical on conductor side underneath the frame. Yep, there it is. Above the fuel tank. It's kind of weird how I transitioned my building style real quick. You just adapt quicker than most people. I finally just said, you know, I build nice engines, but this, it, it really just hit, this is Gary's mob. Yeah. You don't, like, I like PT1 too, all the fancy stuff, but just, you don't need it. Just simplistic. Oh. Did we just? I mean, go you just look at this thing. Yeah. No gauges. No nothing. Uses the same chip that I was using four years ago. True. It's the same chip. Shortliner, if you're still watching, these engines are using the same chip that you gave me four years ago. He probably didn't hear that. He probably ain't here. He's but probably. You get the point. Sleeping. I could message that to him or something. There's no reason to change it because it works just fine. Yeah. Sounds good too. The sounds are a little screwy. Not like just like that. You can't do much about that. But I'm used to it. I'm used to it too, so I don't worry about it. It's just a video game. You don't need anything 100% real easy. That's the way I, I think the model offsets a lot of that. And sounds sound fine anyway. Yeah. I've got no problem with it. God, that is a corner. Build the engines. Let's do it. What was that? You staticked out for a minute. Build the engines. Oh, okay. You worry. Is that me? Because like um, these engines will stack. TK. I think I'm I static. You, you're kind of yeah. You you are staticky. Oh, shut up, man. Oh, you might just shut down that window or whatever if you still have it open. Either that or it's me, I, I can't tell. Yeah. Um, almost. You're still a little staticky. Um, your ping seems to be fine though. Lower pink than I do. Uh, say something. Okay, I didn't hear you. Uh, I'm back. Oh, there you are. Yep, you're back. Thank you, Internet. <laughs> I'm just gonna say, just shut up, run the train. I'll be quiet. Yeah, it's fine. 
Open up on Mecklenburg again. Yeah, no, I do agree with you. This is more simplistic, and there's nothing really wrong with anything. It's fine the way it is. Plus, over the four years that you've been in this game, miraculously, it's you streamlined the style that you've kind of gone with here, perfected it, so to speak. It's funny, I have people ask me what I use to power my engines. Because they don't know. Really? AB's so old, it's just... I don't know any other person besides kind of Matt, you, me, that still use AB. Huh. It's... No one uses this anymore. Damn. I, I still thought there was like a small group of people out there, like people that are beginning to train build, but I guess they just automatically jumped that newer shit. It's got more to, no more to offer, and everyone likes to overcomplicate this game. I guess so. I like Minecraft. Like, Minecraft was good, and then they just added too much stuff where it made it just not enjoyable. Yeah. It is and is, but it depends. That, oh, you that's get the one thing on too. It also depends on the player base and the people, what they want in the game, or want out of the mods in the game. It, you know, it's a whole thing. But yeah, I don't know. I kind of like simplistic stuff too. In the it's always the small things, too, that you appreciate. Uh, I don't know. That's just my two cents on it, I guess. Yeah, we should do more of these type of things. Just, like, either do a convoy in ATS or do a run and train some and just talk about random shit. Keeps you occupied. No, even live streaming. That's what Elf initially wanted to do. That's what he actually did a few of his... Well, with his channel before, it just kind of died a little bit. Not entirely, but... Literally. I never enjoyed podcasts like that. Yeah. Like, yeah. they're real popular, but it's like you're in a conversation yeah. but you're not allowed to speak yeah, it's kind of weird I don't know there's just a lot of things that boot digital that makes sense like a lot of people would rather sitting in an actual group with another person or two they rather listen to the exact same one online somewhere if we're gonna, if I want to hear two people speak about a random subject for three hours, I want to be part of the conversation. Yeah. Not just listen to two people babble back and forth. Yeah. It would make more sense. Okay. climb. At least we made it from Mecklenburg. Haven't had any trouble on the way back up. Out of the woods, yeah, but yeah. Well, we see the tree line out of that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's a good way. It's funny how you say the tree line, and there's on both sides of us a tree line. Shut up! <laughs> I know. I just find it funny. We had a good accelerometer. 
Jazzy still has his. It still works. It's kind of finicky, yeah. really. True. It's honestly one of the most important things it is. in running. Because just like that, you can tell if you're losing speed, gaining speed. Yeah. Even though it's it's not accurate, hardly at all, it still tells you a lot. Yeah. Especially with a train, because you know you got all that by. One thing I really like what you did, how you've got. I'll take a screenshot too for later for example, but. Uh, I like how you've centered the seat in this cab, where it perfectly aligns the handrail with the rail. That makes sense. Well, now we're going around a curve, so it, um, I'll show you later because I took a screenshot. You could just look at it. At the like street. how the seat. Yeah. You can look back straight. No, like I'm looking forward here, and uh, the. Um, so if you you can see from your conductor's seat the uh, the front grab iron of the front mm -hmm. of the locomotive on oh, my the side, rails. yeah, it aligns perfectly with the rail of the track, the rail head. It, it's symmetrical, if that makes sense. I'll show you because I well, took here's the well another thing is your cab seat, the one you're in, mm -hmm. is aligned perfectly with that window, ah. and then that sun visor is lined perfectly and then this radio antenna is lined perfectly everything right there is in a straight line well the antenna is pushed forward slightly uh, but you get the point you're centered with that window yeah and that's how it is on emd drawings okay that's one way to do it this is by the book that's why i like these engines they're not just like slapped together, like even though I didn't of course I didn't make the model. Yeah. I everything's positioned how it would be. That's one way to do it. There you go. One crossing down. One to go. Alright, well, for that town. Amazes me how close the spec drove has actually gotten with these. Well, one thing I like is here, keep running, but like go into third person and look at the cab roof. Yeah. Look how it wraps onto the um, long hood over your battery, over your electrical cabinet. Oh. Yeah. Like that's a cab sheet right there. And see how they extend over the door on the other side? Yeah. That's to prevent rain from dripping down over that window. And on you when you walk out. Oh, okay. Yeah. And to keep rain out of the cabs seeping through the door. Okay. Pretty good. Do they have one for the front or a variation for the front too? Or? <laughs> Not that I've seen. Okay. Well, I, there is one, like, with an extended cab, where, like, the two front windows are pushed forward ah. slightly. I've never seen that, but I've seen pictures of it. Okay. Yeah, it's weird. That, that whole center section of the cab is pushed forward about a foot. Huh. I'll try and find a picture of it later. Eh, you don't have to worry about it. But then the cab sheet had to be cut out differently, and then it extends just like the rear. Okay. Was that an aftermarket thing, or was that from the factory? Uh, EMD offered it. Oh, okay. I don't know why. I can't think of a purpose it serves. Oh, well. Yeah. Whatever real road The extra cab space, I guess. Extra cat space. It reminds me of that Habco GP, GP9. You remember that? The one with the nose completely amputated? Yeah, and the cabs extended. Looks like a living room window? Yep. Uh, that's just for visibility, you know. 
whatever that engine does, it needs someone needs to see what they're doing. Stay here so we know someone's actually watching. No, don't. Leave while no. you still can. Okay. That's a cover bridge. Numpad 3. Numpad 3. Thank you. So it wasn't on. Well, you can tell when it's on and off. Kinda. Also, I adjusted my headlights the okay. same way Jazzy did it on the DMA. Oh, did he? Or they're well the same brightness and like distance. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Random platform with house in the middle of nowhere. Probably a crew stop, really. I was about to say. For, whoever, for everyone who works over there on their side. Yeah. I guess that's a steel mill, supposed to be. No, it's lumber camp. Oh, I was talking across the lake over there, but okay, that works too. Oh, well, it's all the same place. Man. Be careful around this bend right here. Right here? It likes to jump people. I think the is a tunnel right here. No, it's next uh, bend. Yeah, it should be the next bend. I know we're coming close to it since we went past the bridge. That's right, you're not with Pepsi anymore. Yeah, I moved. <laughs> yeah, I'll just probably apply to Pepsi again down here from something. Was well, there a Pepsi place nearby? Uh, I think it's a town over, which it's only like a 20 minute drive. I know they got Coca Cola. I've been seeing a load of Coca Cola trucks around here. I'm going Coca Cola now. <laughs> yeah, that was the running gag. Network is like if something happened that we didn't like, we just threaten to HR. Is like, screw this, I'll go to Coke. Don't do it. <laughs> Why See, not? look at that headlight. And that's wonderful. I like that. Here's where the next town is. Uh, Ashboro. Yes, sir. Look at that, almost there. And then we cut the... We'll take the power back up to where it was. Yeah, kind of figured. Bring it back home. So wait a minute, is this supposed to be a Can I know I've asked this question before, but is this supposed to be a Canadian railroad or is this an Arkansas railroad? Canadian. Ah, okay. I could never tell.
Stay on the track back there, G. Thing worries me. I look back at it, and it's just rattling. What's going to worry me if you hit a kid at this crossing? Oh. Salt. No one saw it, it didn't happen. Yep. That's what I say when I run stoplights. <laughs> I did that the other day and today. No one saw it, it didn't happen. Problem is, people did see it. <laughs> well, then it did happen. <laughs> it wasn't my fault. Well, <laughs> it wasn't your fault. <laughs> I couldn't see. There was a truck in the front, in the way. Solid in that. Exactly. Well, that's the problem. There's an 18 wheeler in front of me. Right. About a. I usually keep three cars distance, but it was about two and a half. And uh, right as. Pretty close. He... Huh? Pretty close. Uh, it's fine. It's just a recommendation. But uh, right as he cleared the light and I seen over the top of his trailer, I seen it was red. I was like, well, shit. <laughs> I just scoot on back with the semi over the road. Yeah. Like, I did attempt to hit my brake, but then I figured by the time I stopped, I'd be in the middle of the intersection. Then no one was coming, so I was like, ah, we're going for it. The last time before that, it was a stop sign, and I didn't see it. Quite frankly, because it was in a Walmart parking lot. No one tends to stop for those anyway. Um, I haven't been to Walmart. Last time I was in Walmart, it was early morning, and even in the early morning, you saw the weirdest, goofy people. And when I was walking up to the Walmart, they had, like, Disney music playing. Really? The hell? It's just like, oh my god, Did what they have, have I kids, done? or were they just... No, they're just playing Disney music, just like casual music. Oh, you mean on the... The, the, the big just, speakers, the big yeah. Speak oh, okay. Outside. I, I, you could hear it from the street. Damn. It's like, oh my god, what am I doing? And you know what I was in there for? A lint roller. Really? They still make that those. Was four, that was two years ago. Damn. I hadn't been to Walmart since. You should go back and see what kind of music they're playing now. God, no. I don't go near a Walmart. <laughs> I, I don't blame you. I try to avoid it when I can, too. I just, Cows! Oh. We honked at them on the way through first, but... Well, you do it each way. Okay. Pay our respects to the fallen cows. To the fallen soldiers. We are not vegan, that's not what we endorse. Yep. It's like, I enjoy a salad every now and then, but I like a hamburger too. Why, why, are, why are people vegan? I have no idea. If you don't want cows on the earth, how about you eat the cows? Yep. Alright. Here comes the fun part. So, how are we going to do this? We're going to pull all the way up, past the yard, and back push in. Okay. It would have made more sense if we pulled them, but alright. No, it wouldn't. Because then we'd take up two yard ladders. Deer! What? Um, okay. It's that much. Boom! Nah, it's fine. It'll buff. As long as he didn't yell moose. No, I did yell moose. Oh, did you? Yeah, look at our train. It's up the wall. Oh. Damn. Not again. 
All right, let me get out of here. Oh, oh, I'm on top of. You want me to slow down? I'm about to fall between cars. Oh, there we go. No, I just killed our conductor. You got a backup camera. We talked about that earlier. That surprises me. That some locomotives have backup cameras. How does that even work, too? Does it go in for the HDMI screen? Do you turn it yeah. on? Yeah. You've got a little monitor in the cab. Huh. Just the same way how your car works. So it just naturally, automatically comes on when you throw it in reverse? It's for certain applications. Oh, okay. And it's also for, like, RCL. Oh, okay. So you can see what's going on. Like, it's on your little controller, see, little that, screen. that would make more sense if it's on an, un, you know, where you're doing Eight cars. Jobs. How many cars? Eight. Eight. Well, right. now, five. Five. Four, four, three, three, two, two, one, one, half, half, good, good. Let me knock the COT out. Alright, holding. It amazes me there's been like one whole person that's still been watching the stream other than me. Whoever you are, you're a champ. Thank you. Alright, take it on back. Take it on back. It's like I've been watching it fluctuate on and off. So. Can't ride that car, so yeah. I'll just ride the truck set. Oh! What? Stop, stop. Stopping, stopping. I went to go ride a car and then I flipped the switch. Release him. Really? It's only one truck, no more. Alright, good. Oh, I felt that. Did you? Yeah, I did. There's more moves you have to make when pulling into the yard. When okay. you shove in, it's literally shove in, drop off, leave. When you pull in, there's the act of flipping those switches, pulling in, flipping more switches, pulling out, taking the power out, uh, and then leaving. Gotcha. I learned that from my aunt. I still like. Now, if you're uh, like on a big class one, oh, yeah. you can pull into the yard, then the yard crew deals with it. Ah, okay. But when it's just like a short line, like this, mm -hmm. where you gotta do a lot of the work, pull, yeah. pushing into a yard works a lot better. Two cars. Two cars. One. One. That'll do. That'll do it. Over here is good. Alright, now to not block this crossing. That's like, about that. from earlier. Yeah. Take it in, two of them. Two of them. Come on, Bessie, you can do it. See the power up there. You can see it, but I can't see you. I'm jumping. Lord, I'm again. That'll do. That'll do. Gotta walk all the way up in there. Sorry. You want me to get you one of those um, two wheeled things that auto stabilize themselves that mall cops use? Whatever A Segway? Yes, thank you. I've got yeah, one. Yeah, I need one of those. I've, I'll, I'll dig it out. Hold on. I know I've got one somewhere. Just continue with our work. Okay, fine. Mm, take it out. Take it ahead. Give it three. Giving it three. Oh, two. Or two. Giving it two. Mm. 
One. One. Oh. What happened? Uh, TK? You hit the button. Um, problem. Server shutting down. Well, cut the stream, that was good. Did, are you still on the server? No. Hmm. That was weird. Hold on. That's not supposed to happen. What happened? I'm able to... Oh, it's on Rice Harbor. Oh, it restarted. I know what it did. It's 12 <laughs> central time. That's why it did that. I forget it restarts. Midnight!